Communication between crocodiles starts even before they've hatched. A tranquil pool in Argentina, and in it, a female, broad-snouted caiman. She laid her eggs in a pile of vegetation close to the water almost three months ago. Now, sounds are coming from it. The eggs are beginning to hatch. Even while the eggs are still within the nest, their mother can hear them from some way away. Back on the nest, she listens intently. Then, very gently, she starts to take it apart. She can't know exactly where each of her babies is and stops every few seconds to listen. the young are free. But she doesn't abandon them. She is going to take them down to the pool that she's selected as their nursery. Some babies start to make the journey for themselves. But they continue to call, and that helps their mother locate them. Cayman jaws are among the strongest in the animal kingdom, but now she uses hers with the greatest delicacy and gentleness. So, at last, her babies are brought together in the nursery pool. But their mother's job is still not finished. Several of the eggs have failed to hatch. One by one, she takes these in her mouth. The shell around the egg is quite strong. The babies must make a considerable effort to free themselves, and for some, it's more than they can manage. So she starts to crack the unhatched egg with her teeth. Once the hard shell has been broken away, she has to pierce the leathery inner membrane. Without her help, this baby might not have hatched at all.